It's Madden NFL 24, and this one features Chigazine McConquo. He's putting together one of the better seasons in league history. It's the Titans and the Packers under the lights on Sunday night. Welcome to Rum to Games, everybody. This is Madden 24, almost said there with WWE. This is not WWE. And for the first time, the Titans meet the Packers here on Madden. Brooks, first time meeting the Packers as well, as this is the second year on the Titans. take a look at this Titan ball club entering play. It's been perfection so far. They come in here unbeaten at 14 and 0. And just two wins away from doing something only two teams have ever done for the most. We're undefeated so again Titans so far at this early of this uh, well, late season, second season. And we're already season. looking like we're going to be the first from the bracket once again. And we're going to start things with um, a rush. These guys have great defense. I read it. They're like number five or number two on a chart. So, well, here we go. They'll start on the ground here on first down. And a short pick. And they didn't do too good down there. The numbers on the ground for Henry last week. The hat trick plus one, four trips to the end zone with his legs. That's nice. And partner, you know how all the guys do when they do that little symbol now. All right, they did this. Keep feeding me, feeding me. They just toss. kept feeding him and feeding him, and next thing you know, he kept getting in the end zone. Taking a deep shot here for oh. Hartman, and that gonna be incomplete. Mm-hmm. This is gonna be a, a good shot, game, y'all. Charles, you think about this offense, and it's kind of a tricky time of the season because you're 14 and 0, looking to see this one out to the end, but you start to run into situations where guys are getting a little banged up. Maybe could use some time sharing, some time on the bench, just to rest. How do you approach the rest of this regular season? I'm telling you, you don't ask the easy stuff, do you? I mean, you created a heck of a situation there, and actually, you didn't create it. You presented it, and you're exactly right. It is tricky because your eye has to be on the. Now a diving effort right sideline. He's got it, and he has a big gain inside the 40 before being dropped. Chewing up big yardage. Another nice gain there. This one goes for 20. So into Packer territory now. Here's first and 10 at the 39-yard line. The handoff running left. Henry and running with power here. Still on his feet and into the end zone. Wow, what a huge uh, tank size Henry, man. Went through it like he's the world's strongest man, Mark Henry. He was taking off. I was about to get tackled. Shoved him off. A little spinning stiff. And he got tackled, but he was right there in the goal. Made sure he was right there. And even if we got tackled, hell is it gonna stop him from making that goal? Woo, buddy! We got a good uh, start of this game. We are gonna be tied with the Packers. And the Packers are gonna win three more. Oh boy. And that last drive, it was all about the ground game, ground and pound. And I don't care how we're playing the game these days. Offensive linemen still want to fire out and smack the guy opposite them and move the football on the ground. They feel better about that. All right. Hopkins is there to catch the ball and make some yards. Number one receiver on the Titans. And a first down. And a duo of books. <laughs> We're gonna do a little Ohio spacing. Let's see if we can get some time. He lets this one fly toward the back of the end zone. Yeah! Leah Hopkins again shows why he's fifth. He is fifth in the most yards. As a wide receiver. 
was open in the defense to get the pass to. When you put the time in, sometimes you have that great silent communication that you just noticed right there because the best quarterback receiver combos in the NFL, they know how to make those adjustments at the Their quarterback in this offense heading back out to the field. He hooked up on the last drive with DeAndre Hopkins for the touchdown. And now set to go here again. First and ten. There we go with some passing game. Throwing to start the drive. Brooks. That a terrible away. throw. It falls down incomplete. Yes, sir. How about an out of boy there on first down? Got his hand in and knocked it away. So after the incompletion on first, now second and ten. Mm. Back to throw. Brooks. And this is dropped. Oh, it's incomplete. He had a big gainer in his sights, but he could not reel it in. Okay. Concentration so key on a ball like that. It's hard. I know how difficult it is, but that's a ball you've got to come up with. And instead, a big play is going to slip through their fingers, literally and figuratively. That is caught. All right, there we go. Art man, kitchen. Boy, Alexander, why you got to be in his face? Or I don't know what's going on. Maybe he was trying to help him up, and and Hartman got mad because he was getting help from his uh, the opponent. And the best receivers I've talked with, they know that stat, and it drives them crazy because they understand that without a quarterback, they don't make the plays that they make. But they also don't feel like they get enough credit for bailing out some of the throws the quarterbacks make. Absolutely, takes two to tango. First down there, but it's incomplete. I like what they tried to do there. They didn't get a completed pass downfield, but they came off a momentum play. Big time gain on the previous snap. Came right back and threw one deep, hoping to catch him on their heels. Now a throw complete to his fullback out of the backfield. That'll leave him with a third and two coming up. They got eight yards there. It's pretty easy to overlook the fullback when you're making your assignments defensively in the pass coverage game, but in this case, they made him pay for that oversight and picks up a nice game. Brooks off the play fake. Down to the 10. Touchdown, Titans. DeAndre Hopkins. Here we go. That's career touchdown. No, no. All right. Oh, hi. Uh, pretty good. Um, <clears throat> hi. My name is Rumsey Games. How you doing? Three touchdowns. An absolute total team effort right now. Three touchdowns. I don't think he's done. We're still. We're doing pretty good, but these Packers, I was about to say, are going to get some score points here. Their offense is just as good as mine. Which means the defense needs to do a better job. Okay. <laughs> Because well, eventually we're going to screw up. And when we do, the Packers will be there to make us eight. Do the same plays here. Got it. Hawkins is. You got it again. Hawkins is this. I don't know. He's good at catching and he's good at running. He got, he got pretty good speed. And I guess it's easier because I guess because I'm right-handed, I always go for the uh, right or left side. I don't know. On a controller, you know, you always end up pushing the square. And I'm pretty sure on Xbox, you would just press. I think B. It's like I don't know. It's just playing in your mind. <laughs> I playing it. Yes, that's, that's the go-to. Go with a little mish. Now Brooks. 
throwing to start the drive. Looking downfield, and that's caught right side. He's got his man. Two catches in the first half. Now he's got a third here, and it's good for a first. Off the bootleg. Brooks. DeAndre Hopkins making the catch. Touchdown. DeAndre Hopkins. 56 yards. And the Titans come right out of the locker room and score here in the opening minute. Here's Tennessee ready to begin this drive offensively. Now Brooks to throw. Throwing on first down. The hookup on the right side to Hopkins. This will be stopped about two yards shy of the marker. Eight-yard gain, second and two. Two yards to go, second down. Off the bootleg, Brooks. Across the formation, Hardman gets a completion. And he's got it past the 30 before he's hit and dropped. 13 yards is the pickup for Tennessee and a first down. Looking to throw, Brooks. Throw right side, going to be taken in by Henry. A solid stiff arm. And well, he's going to be out up around the 45 yard line. They'll get 13 yards for the second play in a row. Caught that look from you there, partner. I think we're on the same page on that one. Just his first catch. I think we both thought he'd be a little more active in the passing game. Let's see if that's the start of them trying to get the ball to him a little bit more here in the second half. The throw over the middle, taken in. And he is tackled inside the 49 to the 34. So far, so good. 35 to 17. In our third inning. Not too bad. I know I ain't running with Henry as much. I try not to, to have him run so much because I don't want him to get injured before the playoffs or the Super Bowl. Because I might need him. You know, I guarantee you I need Henry. I need my tank of the Titans. Hopkins on the ground over the middle. And he's got this down almost to the 20 before he's dropped. <laughs> Swimming on grass. Last two plays, they've moved it a combined 33 Hopkins. yards. I'll tell you what, a lot of those mid-range throws have been available because sometimes teams get you never thought doing football for a living. You ever thought about? <laughs> I don't know why I'm grabbing up with some trivia questions like that. That's going to be knocked away and incomplete. And not a common sight, at least on this drive. A momentary you know, I just like feeling a little conversation, you know? Well <laughs> I, know up, I don't play sports, so, connect, you know, that's one of those questions. Down. You ever thought you're a little high school uh, be on the high school team while you become a a football pro football player where you make millions and billions and billions of dollars. I know I couldn't do it. That's some heavy workout tryout just to get through. I heard from it. It's rough. Rock Lesnar tried to do it and he said, nope. <laughs> I'm many things, but nope, I'm good. They kicked his butt. Oh, doing all those drills. Here comes the field general leading his offense back out there for the next possession. And I'm just wondering how many. How many more we got on to get? Man, I would rather have four quarter. <laughs> I'm ready for the game to be over because that means I believe I'll be 16. I know. No, no. They'll be. I'll tell us if we stay in a good. Uh, keep the points up. 
you talking about the little guy back Tiny. there? Tiny. That monster. Yeah, you're exactly right. And it takes a group effort to get a guy. Whoa. Like that. He's that. open. He's down. Pops. No, that's a Akaro. <laughs> He's standing there. Come the Titans now. Been a very strong performance for them, really on both sides of the football. The turnover on downs is the most recent example, and now obviously they're in a great spot here. If you're over on the yeah, we're in a great spot. We're beating the Packers. We're giving them a little tight Nice. Now you just don't get careless. Take care of the ball on the way out. A good start to the nice. That's caught out on the Jump and pop. Yeah, he's got this to the 30 before being taken down. That one goes for 24 yards. Well, fans expect these primetime slots to deliver some of the best games each week. And, well, one team has certainly followed through with that tonight. Just an absolute clinic, Charles, on offense here. And they don't seem to be done trying to drive that football. Yeah, and continue. Well, this is taken in. It's good. Wow. Nice catch. By heart, man. The Hitman. We're going to call him the Hitman. Of the Christ control right now here in the fourth. And now, of course, all scoring plays are reviewed, and I think they're going to take an extra long look at this one. They're taking a peek uh -oh. at whether or not those feet were in bounds, and obviously a big call here in the end zone. And not just the feet. How about the hands? How is the ball possessed while the feet are hopefully getting down in bounds? That's what they're trying to yeah, look at. Yeah, like he was in. It all comes together. All right. These guys getting mad. And they trying to say that my players, my teammates, did, were not following the rules. I don't know about you, but my guys are following the rules. You guys are, I don't know. Henry, rush. Dang, I mean, well, I said rush. I mean rush, but I didn't expect you to do all that now. Oh, was I supposed to run? So I never run. I'm going to call it back. I just throw the ball and I just sit there, okay? I just do that in a soccer. I just supposed to land it for my class. Only for my class. I'm not that smart. I'm telling you. I took special ed classes. But anyways, we had special Olympics, which for just my class, right? It was for like bowling. They, did, they started adding basketball and then soccer. And I could, I didn't mind doing bowling and all that, but I always looked forward for soccer. I was a, the goalie and stuff, right? And the Titans getting set to go, and they just continue to roll right along. Really, this has the looks so, of yet another victory. I lost my my trace of thought, y'all. Yeah. <laughs> Oop. Here's Brooks. Off play action. Finding okay. Hardman here over the middle. And they'll get this well past midfield before being stopped just before the 35. Mm -hmm. Up just two, two minute warning. In the fourth quarter of what has been a one sided affair. So the Titans in possession of the football here as we get your reset. And they have just about put this one on ice as they've got it here first and ten. Henry running right. Derek Henry all alone. And he will get into the end zone. Right. Right. Well, we're doing a pretty good job, I think, against these Packers. Really 
really just had one speed, and that's been all out. They're still driving the ball downfield. I told you about a story that I was trying to, I was making it a kind of like an example or whatever I was talking about, and then I forgot. Wonderful. <laughs> you guys ever have that problem? You ever have where you have a trace of thought just leaves your mind? You trying to explain? Here comes Tennessee as they get sent to take the field. I hate that. Yeah, this crowd has certainly liked what they've seen. There they Now it looks like he'll throw here. This pass going to be caught by Hardman. Now he's loose down the middle of the field. And they're going to score again. Yet another touchdown as they just add to their totals. And to me, that touchdown allows you to start grinning widely on your sideline. I think they pretty much locked this one away. Yeah, that's the clincher, the proverbial icing on the cake, if you will. Titans offense now they get ready to do battle again here well, they came into this one with a vision Charles and it has played out exactly as they had hoped if not even better they've got the huge they'll start this drive out on the ground and he's up in it at the 33, following a good pickup of eight. Just what you want on a first down run. Call it eight yards, and it's second and two. The partner under the lights in prime time. This offense, they gave the nation quite a show, putting up that many points to come away with what will certainly be a memorable win for them. And Brandon, I think it's as simple as this. Some players, some teams, they're just meant for the big stage. And when they get a chance to play in this type of atmosphere... Well, well, that was fantastic. So if you guys enjoyed my little ramble, rambling, rambling, rambling. So the Titans, they are now why I repeat myself? Because I'm trying to say this word. Rambling. And they'll hit the road next week to take on the Chicago Bears. <laughs> With for some Bay, odd word of talking, like I'm and doing now. Please leave a thumbs week. up. For a look at new US subscribe. I'll see you with the in the next video. Bye bye.